Hamilton had begun the weekend with a 34-point lead over Vettel, but it is now 59 points with four races remaining. Hamilton could now claim his fourth world championship at the next round at the Circuit of the Americas. He needs to score 16 more points than the German in Texas to do so, and a win with Vettel finishing in sixth or worse would be enough. The season had been a nip and tuck affair between the two drivers, with Vettel holding the lead until Monza, but after Hamilton's victory in Italy, put his nose in front for the first time, he has enjoyed a decisive swing in his favour. Vettel went out after the opening lap crash in Singapore and could manage only fourth in Malaysia after taking a 20-place grid penalty for using a new engine. It has been a sequence of races, concluding here in Suzuka, that has completely changed the complexion of the championship. It is normal to be critical, especially when things go wrong, said Vettel, of his Ferrari team. I think I need to protect them. We have done an incredible job so far. It is like that sometimes, of course it hurts, and we are all disappointed. We go flat out for the last four races and see what happens. We still have a chance this year, it depends what happens today, it is not as much in our control as we would like, but overall the team is in a good way. I think we have got further than people thought. We have a lot of positives, but today is not a day to look at positives. Advertisement this was the three-time world champion's eighth win of the season, his 61st career victory and his fourth from the last five races. He has now won the Japanese Grand Prix four times, with three victories here in Suzuka and one at Fuji in 2007. He had been untouchable in claiming pole, and although he had expected to face greater competition during the race he had the measure of it from the off, just as he had at Spa running from poles to the flag and controlling it from the front. Hamilton had made a clean start on the 373 meters run down to turn one and held his lead, but Vettel had caught by Verstappen at the hairpin, and the young Dutch driver skillfully claimed second place. Guardian Australia Sport Newsletter, subscribe by email. Read more. It swiftly became clear however that the German, was struggling for pace and had some from a problem. He had a faulty spark plug on the grid which Ferrari had believed they had dealt with, but Vettel had an issue and was struggling for power. By the start of the second lap he was promptly passed by Esteban Ocon, Ricciardo, and Bottas and dropped to sixth. 